Assalamu alaikum everyone and welcome back to Nina's Mom Kitchen. Today my mom is going to make the delicious lazy zaras malai. It's quite delicious and creamy and you can feel the flavor of the milk and the cream in it. So do try this recipe in your, recipe in your home and tell us in the comment box about it. So let's begin the recipe without any delay. But before I start, if you're new on our channel, do subscribe it, like it and share it. And if you're new on our channel, don't forget to press the bell icon as well. So over here we have taken the lozies of our Now we're going to pour it into the bowl. After that, on the other hand, we're going to take the fresh milk, one and a half liter, but open uh, with one cup of water and bring it to boil. After that, we're going to add a few threads of saffron and to open cardamoms, add half cup sugar and mix it well. Now, over here, we're going to add the 5 teaspoon cooking oil on it and mix it well. Now we are going to add the 4 tablespoon beaten egg in it and if your dough is hot, you are going to add the remaining egg, otherwise just go with it. The dough was a bit sticky, so just my mom uh, placed it in another place. Now we are going to grease our hand with the oil and make small balls of it. So we have totally made 12 balls of it. You can also make 18 balls, 28 balls, 13 balls or any other amount of ball you want to make. It depends upon your family members in your home. Now we are going to add these balls into the boiling milk and then we are going to rotate them gently with the help of a flat spoon as you can see over here. After 7 to 8 minutes, a size gets double and then after it's double, you're gonna turn off the flame. So let's dish out it right now. It was quite delicious, yummy, creamy, juicy, everything delicious Ras Malai. I couldn't even stop myself while eating it. It was too much delicious. And after that, you're gonna uh, put them into the freezer so that you can enhance the taste of the Ras Malai. You can also garnish them with the pistachios or almonds or any other dry fruit you want to use. Alright, so over here our recipe ends. So let's see in the next recipe. But before I leave, I must request you all that if you like this video, just give it a big thumbs up. Allah Hafiz.